Okay, Jeff Magnus with the Curdy Zephyr. We just heard you talk about the kit build. Could you tell us a bit about how the helicopter flies? Oh, it's, a, it's absolutely a delight to fly. First of all, it's a two-place helicopter with a turbine engine. 100, 251 horsepower, derated to 141 horsepower, and it's got dual FADEX, so when you start the engine, unlike a traditional helicopter that has a throttle on the collective, we have a knob on the panel, and it starts out at idle, goes to 55%, then goes to run, which is 90%, and the engine stays at 90%. And the neat part about that whole deal is because we get 100 horsepower extra in derating, you get all the torque immediately. We can cruise at 15,500 feet, and we have an HOG uh, that's hover above ground at 14,100 feet. It is just as nice as can be. You sit very upright in the very comfortable seats, very ergonomical. The yoke is placed in the collective right where you need it, and so are the foot pedals. So for the actual kit build, what does the kit look like when it arrives to the customer? The kit will be in nine parts, and it has a manual that's probably close to 900 pages. It tells you exactly where to put what nut, what bolt. It gives you pictures. It's incredibly detailed. The company that builds it is called Curti International, C-U-R-T-I. It's an Italian company. They were resided where the Imola racetrack is in Italy. Their neighbors happen to be Ferrari, Lamborghini. The quality of the workmanship is the best I've ever seen. Things do exactly what they're supposed to do. There's no wobble, there's no weave. You look at how it's set up for different situations and they've really anticipated about everything that I can think of. The build is, I don't wanna say simple because I don't think any build is simple, but this is very, very well laid out and you do one portion after the next portion. The fuselage comes in two pieces, they're carbon fiber and you put them together. It doesn't come painted, you gotta paint it. You have to put in the glass. This is the first helicopter that comes with a parachute. The really neat thing about it is when this parachute is deployed, the helicopter drifts down at the same rate you would as if you jumped out of an airplane with a parachute. Not only that, it sits on the top of the mast so it doesn't destroy any part of the helicopter. When the helicopter lands, it's intact. It doesn't destroy it, it doesn't hurt it. It really is a nice deal. Let's say you land and you decide to fix, you can fix what the problem was. You can take the parachute off the top and fly it away. We also have 12 cubic feet of storage that you can put it in. In fact, the helicopter is so versatile, you can fill the tanks, put two 200 pound pilots in it and still have 700 pounds of useful load left. That's a sweet deal in a helicopter. It sure is, thank you so much, Jeff. Aviation Safety Resources is disrupting the market for aircraft emergency parachute recovery systems. ASR systems are smaller, lighter weight, and offer longer repack cycles than similar products available in the current market. ASR has a recovery system available for every type of aircraft. Sport, experimental, light sport, general aviation, urban air mobility, vertical takeoff and landing, electric propulsion, and unmanned aerial systems. Find the right product for your aircraft at aviationsafetyresources.com.